We do go. Have some respect. This really isn't the time to talk. Glad you made it inside. Doubt we'll be safe here for long, though. There'll be more coming. Goblins hunting packs. Maybe, but we're not fighters. If they broke through, it'd be a massacre. The sooner we leave for Baldur's Gate, the better. If the road was clear, a ten days' walk, maybe? But while the goblins are out there, it might as well be the other side of the world. Oh, Salona, our lady of silver. Nothing. I feel like we're being watched. Oh, Salona. Over there. Our lady of silver. Please. May he rest by your side. He... He never hurt anyone. He always knew what to say. When I was
up and up. I need a quick word. You have good timing. Never been much of a fighter, so wrestling a bugbear would have gone... poorly. But you're not here for heroics, are you? Avernus's stench is all over your skin. Let me guess. Your devil mistress sent you to get her soul coin back. But too bad. I earned it, fair and square. Devils just can't stand to lose. Here. Now go back to the pit that made you. No one back home will ever believe this. All right. What now? Peer through the telescope. You see a dragon circling like a bird of prey, hunting. The telescope points to the left. The telescope points straight ahead. The telescope points to the right. The telescope points straight ahead. Breathe deep and move. Glad you were here for those goblins. Picked one off yesterday myself. Shot her through the throat. Well, that should have killed her, but... She kept gasping. Clawing at the arrow. Why? It was terrible. 
terrible. I should have just looked away. If I see a goblin, I'm closing this gate, whether you're inside or not. So, you know about these parasites. Will we survive them? Only if my people extract them. The only other cure is the blade. Okay. Oh. What a waste. I told them to run, the idiots! You better turn north here, or you'll end up like them. Damn it. I wish we could at least have given them a proper burial. Thought you was busy with the foul bloods in Elson's Grove. Sucker punching strangers. That's your bit, right? Not no more. The contract didn't mention no goblins. I would have prepped the lads, brought better weapons. The kind that leaves half your crew dead. There's a wizard in Baldur's Gate that'll pay gobloads for a relic, supposedly buried round these parts. But gold ain't any use if you're too cold to spend it. Have at it. If you think you can do better. It's called the Night Song. It's supposed to be hidden under the temple where the goblins jumped us. I'd give you a map of the temple and wish you a happy funeral. But my mate Brian kept hold of it like his own sodger. Goblins made sure to the fat old junk. All I've got's the contract. Can show you where we turn back if you feel like dying. You bleed from every orifice. Your bones will change form. Your jaw will split to allow room for four great tentacles. All skin will turn to gore and be shed to reveal new flesh underneath. Then you have ceased to exist, and a mind flayer is born. Words forged in steel. May your actions express the same metal. We must find my kind and be rid of the parasite. It's as simple as that. The first symptoms should have long since started, though. That is what puzzles me. Yes, if you give it no further thought. 
but anomalies lead to surprises. Bad surprises. Besides, what hasn't happened may yet come to pass. Just want Marina back. Well, hello. Ready or not, silent is the grave. It's a mild plan. Do you harass every old woman you meet? Tell us where she is. We don't want any trouble. But you're bloody getting some if you don't fess up. Assume nothing. All's well that ends. Not as bad as it could have. She went to see you. We know she did. You know absolutely nothing, you Aegis. Drop the act. Lads, for the love of all that is holy, I've never clapped eyes on your poor sister. Drop the act, hag. You was the last to see me, Rena. Just let her go. Please. Thank goodness you're here, sweetie. I, I don't know what's come over these boys. Auntie Ethel's face creases with false concern. You realize she's lying about seeing this girl, Marina. Stop this. We, we won't ask again. You were supposed to rush to my defense, love. Fat lot of good you are. Some advice? You ever darken my door, you'd best have that head bowed and an apology at the ready. Bye bye now. Bloody hells. She just disappeared. Ain't seen nothing like that before. She could shoot fireworks out of her backside for all I care. The hug has Rina. It's our sister, Marina. She's... Well... She was in a bad way after her husband died. Started saying weird things, like how she was gonna bring him back. Next thing, she's gone looking for the hag. Of all the stupid things to do. And we haven't seen her since. And no good ever came from dealing with a hag. None of this matters, all right? We need to get her back, and fast! And we've no need of a mouthy bastard. Come on, Demir. We'll make our own way. More for me?
should mind my step. Hello and welcome to Bogrot. Now, kindly, gives all your stuff. A strange symbol glows, marked on their flesh, and something within you stirs in response. True soul. Right. Uh, welcome to Bogrot. A shiver runs across your mind. You feel sated. Or whatever you want to call it. It's your town now. <laughs>
So the tadpole gives us the ability to influence others. Ignore it. Deny it. This is nothing but a disease, and every use will sicken us further. <laughs> Nonsense. Any power freely given is a power well received, and this is a valuable power indeed. Wise counsel, when the temptation calls, keep silent or suffer. What's the roundup? Nothing. Bless you like trash. Then keep looking. Looks empty. No traps, please. Don't give me trouble now. to fly. Stop this thing! <laughs> Flap those wings some more and I'll feed you a worm. And you. Hope you got a stomach for rights. What's it? <laughs> 